Hi. I'm Rod from Tavel. I'm here to tell you about narration software that automates voiceovers and PowerPoint and e-learning. It's called SpeechOver and it helps produce effective narrated e-learning and training courses quickly and inexpensively. First of all, SpeechOver does not just read the text on the screen in book-based e-learning. It is much more ambitious. SpeechOver creates the lecturer's narration track in lecture-based e-learning. It completely eliminates microphone recordings and voice talents. Developers enter the text for the lecturer's narration, and SpeechOver converts the text into the lecturer's voice in seconds. Let's see how SpeechOver adds a narration clip to a slide directly from the narration text in seconds. Right-click on the background of the slide and select Add Slide Clip. Enter a title for the narration clip. Enter the text for the narration in the dialog. And click OK. Keep your eye on the animation pane where the narration effects will appear. Wow! In seconds, SpeechOver has generated the narration. Let's look at the components of the narration. The first effect is the slide narration clip document shape located below the visible screen. The second effect is a sound media effect that plays the narration sound file. And here is the sound file that was created. The last effects are subtitles that are coordinated with the spoken text. Also created automatically by SpeechOver. Finally, here are the speech notes. They are the narration text formatted and written to the PowerPoint notes pane for people who prefer reading the text. Now, let's see how SpeechOver creates narration clips that are synced to the appearance of text bullets, or graphics. Right-click anywhere on the text bullet and select New Shape Clip. Enter the text for the narration in the dialog. And click OK. Watch the animation pane. SpeechOver has generated the narration in seconds. Let's look at the components of the narration. The first effect is the appear animation effect for the text bullet. If no animation effect exists, SpeechOver creates it. The second effect is the narration media effect. It follows immediately after the appear effect for the text bullet. This causes the narration to be synced with the appearance of the text bullet. The last effects are subtitles that are coordinated with the spoken text. Finally, here are the speech notes. We have now added two narration clips on this slide. They play in the order they appear on the clip organizer. You can change the order with the up-down arrows. control the articulation and phrasing of TTS voices in the SAPI editor. Following grammar-based guidelines, add special punctuation in the text that creates the pauses and accents of a real professional voiceover. SpeechOver provides three types of pauses. A short rhetorical pause to break a sentence into clauses and phrases and to accent words, represented by a vertical bar. A pause of half a second to separate a phrase, represented by an M dash. A long pause to separate major ideas, represented by a paragraph sign. And, change the speed, pitch, and volume.
Want to hear an example of a TTS voice produced by SpeechOver using the Sappy Editor? Surprise! You have been listening to one. I am Rod, a TTS voice from Acapella. Try me out for your e-learning and training courses today.